Hello interwebs, welcome to Let's Fix Computers. Today I'm replacing the display cable on this MacBook Pro. Um, the display is completely dead on this. The external one works fine though. So um, uh, if the display has graphical artifacts or if the backlight isn't working or you've got backlight but no picture or something like that, it's more likely to be another problem. But if you, the display is completely dead, it's almost certainly going to be the display cable. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and get that changed. I'm going to be speed running this one. so. Um, uh, this will be mostly um, titles rather than talking, so let's get started. Spoiler alert, um, this repair was actually a failure. It transpired to be a problem with the graphics card, which is built into the logic board. Um, and I nearly threw this video out, but because it's got the complete disassembly of the laptop and display assembly, um, I thought I'd hang on to it so you could see how to do it. Um, this is entirely valid for if you're changing the display cable or the LCD panel. So uh, watch on. The display assembly is fairly taxing to take apart on this one. You will need metal prying tools, um, if possible a couple of them. Uh, the basic technique is to literally pry the tools, um, pry the back off of the front. You can see the angle that I'm applying my tools here. Um, it's not as hard as it seems, you just need to lift the back cover over the indentations on the inside cover. Once it starts moving it comes off fairly easily. There's um, a little bit of faff involved in this section where um, in order to get the display cable out I need to disassemble the, um, the hinge section of the display assembly. Um, I actually took out a few more screws than I needed to so uh, there is a screen cut where uh, I just quickly put everything back together again that you guys didn't need to see. Um, but um, if you're only changing the display panel you don't need to take this bit apart. It's only when you're changing the cable or any of the wireless antenna components that you need to get involved in this area. So, But uh, I'll leave it in anyway so you can see what I'm doing.
No, Still nothing. Ah, shit! Maybe try holding it down. Holding it yeah, I suppose I should. Now, this graphics card's knackered, and we are done here. Right, here's a reprise video. I found in my spares bin a broken LCD panel for this laptop. So what I'm gonna do, after my failure with the display cable just then, um, I'm going to, um, because I have a spare display cable, I'm gonna take the cover off and I should be able to plug this LCD in without having to strip the whole thing back again. Now this LCD is cracked and it's no good, however, the backlight on it should light up if there's any life at all. If the backlight comes on on this one, it tells me that this display is dead. So uh, that gives me another option to diagnose without investing any more money. Because the problem is, an LCD for these are about, is about 80 quid at the moment, and that's a big risk to take when you don't know what's wrong. So uh, I'm going to take this cover back off again, plug in this LCD, and see how far we go. Yeah, still dead. Yeah. Gotta be a graphics card.